Hey everybody, welcome to In the Kitchen with Julie. The setting does look a little different around here. A lot of things have changed in the past few months, as in I have moved in with Brittany, me and Erin, to save a little bit of money until I get the house done up there at the land. So today's video is a little different. I can see Brittany peeking through the window at me like a goober. So I'm mean, gonna pull my sleeves up for this one, but I got, I've got to tell you a little backstory before we do this, okay? We're not cooking anything today. So me and this lady where I work, I knew her previous before I worked too. She was telling me about parasites and that we all have them in our body. And I'm sure it has something to do with the crap we eat. How it's processed, how it's grown. We just all need to go back with growing our own food. But anyway, so she was telling me about this detox thing that her and her family does. And some people have parasites in their body that comes out during this detox. So I'm amazed by this. So she sent me a video that had pork chops. I got some right there in that bag. It, they could they could be something in that bag right now, and I, I I wouldn't know. So what you do is you put the pork chop in a container. You pour Pepsi over it. We're going to use Pepsi. Yeah. Y'all want to sponsor me? There you are. This is cherry because I can drink it later. But just saying. <laughs> Sorry, I tickle myself. So anyway, so you put the pork chop in here. You pour the Pepsi on top of it. You wait five minutes or so. And these little things are supposed to start wiggling up like that and it's little parasites. So we're gonna try it and we're gonna see. I've already decided the only pork I'm gonna eat is sausage, because that crap's been ground up so many times. If it wasn't there, it got ground up. And some bacon, because it's cut so thin and it's been cured, it's gonna be dead if it's in there. So we're gonna give this a shot. I've watched the videos, it really happens, or it looks like it happens. Now, at one point, I will have to turn the video off because I gotta move the camera where it's aimed down at the pork chop. I don't want y'all to think some shenanigans are going on. I just move you closer, aim you down, so you're just gonna hear my voice. You're gonna see the bubbly go over the pork chop, and we may see something wiggle around, I don't know. So we're gonna go and see what we can do. But for right now, I am going to go ahead and yeah, I got my sleeves up. I'm not eating this, so it doesn't matter if I touch my hair, rub it on me, or whatever. I even got my glasses because I can see these little wigglers come out. So we went to the local store. That's what I think about that. And got some pork chops. We're going to... Put them in this pan. Now, I will wash my hands after I do this because I got to move the camera. Now. I don't want no crap on my camera. I got some, some German folk, something going on. So, these are some fat boys. Look at that. So, wake up, little guys, if you're in there. Let me massage it a little bit. You know, there's something nasty in that. And I don't think it has anything to do with, like, if it laid out too long or whatever. I think they're just in there. But we just don't know it. So I'm wiggling around a little bit. We got it in our little pan. I'm gonna wash my hands and then we're gonna pour the Pepsi over it and wait and see what happens. Hopefully nothing happens because I'm gonna be grossed out and just fling these suckers out in the yard, okay? So let's hope nothing happens, but if it does, we all gonna watch it together. Hey Brittany, can you hit that button? My hands are dirty, I can't. Hit my remote. It's on the side. Yep, that's it. Okay, I just wanted everybody to see what it looked like behind the scenes right here. You know, this is, I got, oh, I can't see nothing because these are just readers. I got my ring light on because we can see if anything starts moving. And I'm already, you know, meat looks kind of weird if you really magnetize it and look at it. Anyway, so we, oh my God, there's a cat. That's Brittany's cat, by the way. Nasty buzzard. All right, flip her off and let's do this. <laughs> okay, y'all, so we are, y'all heard the little shh. Next thing you're gonna hear is me pouring some in my cup, just in case I get grossed out. Oh, it's overflower. Okay, here we go, we're gonna pour it over. Oh, Jesus. It's 
doing some bubbling and we just gotta sit here and wait Brady, I'm scared okay we just wait I don't see nothing yet. But we do have to wait a little bit. Still nothing. Y'all, I got my glasses on. I ain't seeing nothing moving, though. I'm looking over every inch of this thing. It did take a little bit on the, on the video. At this point, you stare at something so long you think everything's moving. <laughs> Bless you, Brittany. Well. I see little bubbles. But nothing major. y'all see something put it in the comments below but I'm not seeing anything yet I mean in a way I'm kind of happy that I'm not seeing anything but then I'm disappointed yet see on the video it had like little white things starting to pop up and that was like the little parasites I'm not even seeing anything I mean, I guess I can get a fork and poke it. No. I'm getting a fork. I'm going in. poke it y'all wake up little guys are you in there and y'all I would is several videos and there was several with worms coming out of it. Let's flip it over. They didn't flip it over, but I'm going to flip it over. Nothing.
does look gross, but there's nothing wiggling. Okay, y'all. So, I see nothing moving. <laughs> Sorry for the no sniffing. I am going to let this sit here for a little bit. Even after I turn the video off. And then come back and look at it. Just to make sure that nothing's escaping. You never know. Okay, so I'm going to set the camera back up, back on me, and I'll talk to you in a minute about the video. Okay, I'm back. Now, I'm going to leave this sitting out here for just a little bit. Like I said, you know, I really was looking... To see if I could see anything moving or anything. I didn't see anything. That doesn't mean that, you know, I'm going to turn this down because it's so much, it's so bright. That doesn't mean that it didn't happen on somebody else's video. So I am going to let this sit here for another five minutes or so. And then come back and see if I see anything wiggling. If I do, I'm going to turn this video back on. But. It was worth a try. We see stuff, we gotta try it out and see what we think about some of these other videos that we see this on Facebook or YouTube. <clears throat> and so far, <coughs> on this piece of meat, we're good so far. So far, nothing wiggling and worming up out of it like the other videos. But if you would, please go to YouTube or Facebook and just look up pork chops with worms. What the word? My cat had babies and they think they own the kitchen. It's disgusting. I don't like cats on the counters. That's just my opinion. Y'all can have all the cats running around you want. That's, that's, that's for another video. But anyway, it was worth a try. So, so far, nothing. It was a bust on my pork chops anyway. So, we're going to see what y'all find at home. So get you a pork chop, pour your Pepsi over it, or your Coke, either one. It don't matter. I think it's just got to be carbonated and bubbly. So try it at home. If you find something, make your own video. If you find something, let me know. Send me a post. Post it to this video. Show me what you found. Even if it's a still picture of whatever coming out of it, just take your little pictures and send it to me. I would love to see it. So if y'all find something on a video that y'all would like for me to try and see if I can get it to work for myself or not work, let me know. I'll be glad to try pretty much about anything. But anyway, thank you for watching. I know it's been a while. Thanks for hanging in there with me. We'll be getting some more videos up soon. And I'm kind of glad there was nothing wiggling in my pork chop, actually. I mean, but... Somebody found something wiggling in theirs. But that's enough of that. I'm not eating those. I think I'm done with pork. Except for bacon and sausage, like I said. Maybe some liver mush. Pork chops, I have the picture. But thank you so much for watching the video today. I can touch this now. My hands are clean. But thank you so much for tuning in. Please subscribe to my channel. It's In the Kitchen with Julie. And I would love to hear from you or if you have recipes that you want me to try. But thank you so much for hanging in there with me, subscribing, and watching the videos. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.